I'm going to show you in this video one amazing AI tool that will take a piece of video or audio and turn it into, well, you have an option of up to a hundred, a hundred content ideas. In fact, I took this video and turned it into this and this and this and this. Well, and all of this with one click that literally took probably seconds, maybe, okay, maybe a few minutes. All right, so the tool I'm gonna show you is called Cast Magic. Now we're gonna jump into my dashboard and I'm gonna show you a lot of the things I've already done. And then I'm gonna show you a demo of exactly what it can do. So right now we're in my Cast Magic dashboard and these are all the videos that I've already imported. Actually, I imported via the link from my YouTube channel. But the one I wanna look at today is this one right here. That's called Starting a YouTube Channel in 2024. Really good video. If you wanna watch that, there's a link down in the description. But once it transcribes it, here is the transcription. Look at this. It goes on and on and on. You can even, you could just stop right here, but then you don't get all the magic. You can find and replace, you can download this, but here is where this tool <laughs> is, is so good. Here's where this tool really shines. Click on AI content. These are all the prompts that I either created or used from the community prompts. I'll show you that in just a second. That it used to generate all of this. So from that video, from that transcript rather, from my recording, it came up with these YouTube titles. It came up with the short description. This is a prompt that I created. I wanted a very short description based on what I was saying in the video, in the audio. These are keywords. I have this newsletter that I've started called Kevin's Talking About. And so what I decided to do is create a prompt that actually would help me write the newsletter. And here it is, key topics and bullets. So these are takeaways from the video, lessons learned. So whatever you might wanna use this for. Online course. So one of the things that I plan on doing more is creating, I'll call them mini online courses from a lot of the videos that you could take and just learn just, you know, something quickly from there. It, it does that right here. Check this out, fun facts. Here's three fun facts from the video my blog post. So if I wanted to use this to create a blog, there it is. And I had it do a Facebook post and a Twitter post or X post or whatever you call it. Now, those are just the prompts I've put in here for you to see. I don't necessarily use those all, but I just wanted to show you everything it would do. Now, notice this right here, jump. You can actually go anywhere in here. So, cause I know it gets rather long. You can also manage your prompts. So like, for example, let's say, well, I wanted the newsletter Maybe the second one in here, I can do that, or I want my description up here, or I've already got my title, I'll do this. So all you've got to do is rearrange it and it will actually customize it how you wanna see it. Now, even though you have those prompts already in there and it's already generated, you can modify those as well. So let me show you this on the YouTube description. If you click on modify, you can make it longer, make it shorter, make it more casual, serious, rerun the original. You can even add something right there and check this out see the one slash two, it's already done it once. So it will keep everything you've done. So if you do it like three or four times with different prompts, you've got that as well. Now, you know, I mentioned the community prompts. So check this out. If you go right up here to explore community prompts, these are other prompts that have been written by the community. And they'll even tell you who've written them. A lot of them have been by the Cast Magic team, but you can use any of these. So let's say you like this social carousel. All you've got to do is click it and add it to your space and you can even modify it further if you wanted to. And you've got a couple of more options too. You can also go to new custom prompt and this could be whatever you want. So let's say you wanted to do something for LinkedIn. So you could say, I'm gonna do a LinkedIn post. Here you would just say something like create a short LinkedIn or whatever you wanna post from this recording. You can obviously give it a lot more information. You do that and guess what? It's already generating it on this recording that I already have in there. And if I go all the way down to the bottom, there it is right there. So just by doing that, and then you can modify this, you can save it. And now that we have that, we can always use it if we want it. Another button I wanna show you is what's called Magic Chat. If you click that, there's a lot of other prompts in here that I, some of these I've already used, but you can even use these, you can modify these. And then from here, you can also get to the community prompts. So like if I were gonna click this right here, it would actually generate it right here. Then I could save it like I did this one. I could copy it. I can even modify it from here. Now I can copy and paste all of this down and use it, or I can also do this. If you go all the way to the top, you see a little share button. When you click it, you get this box here. 
and I can embed this or I can just share it. I'm going to copy the link and here's what it looks like when you share it. If you notice, there's my transcript and there's all the AI content I created. Okay, I showed you what it did to one of my videos. Let me show you exactly how it works. So we're gonna go right here to import audio or video. Now you can drag your audio clip or your video. And the reason I keep saying audio is because this was also built for podcasting as well. But I've got a YouTube link right here. I'm gonna hit submit. And you notice it's processing. Here's the cool thing. You don't have to sit here and wait for it. It doesn't take long. You'll actually get an email telling you it's ready and you can jump right back in. Okay, I got my email. I've gone back in here and here's the video right here. It just transcribed. Now, one of the things it's gonna ask you is to choose your speaker. I already have that in here. For some reason, it thinks there's two speakers. It's just me. I think I'm enough for everybody. I'll just say that. <laughs> but here's the transcript. Now. We click on AI content and all of those prompts that we have in there will generate in pretty quick time. You actually see them filling in here right now. So we're gonna scroll down and every one of those prompts I showed you, it's just filled in from that video, which is a video about how I almost lost all my media because my external hard drive dry, died, which again, great video, link down there. Here are the titles it came up with. Here's the description, here's the keywords. Here's a newsletter it's already created. And keep in mind, I can modify any of this. Here's some key topics and bullet points. Uh, online courses, or online course rather. Fun facts, a blog post it's created from this, Facebook post, Twitter, and even the LinkedIn post. Now, if you wanna try it for yourself, there is a free trial. There's a link down in the description. So why don't you grab it and see what you think. And if you wanna check out some other really cool AI tools, check out the videos on the screen. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.